Sitting ill, KF nil. We are through to the quarterfinals, but a tough game to watch, Stephen. It was uh, interesting, <laughs> that's what I can put it. It was slow, miserable, cold, but we got there. We're through. But what cost? At what cost? I mean, is it mission accomplished or is it something where we've actually we've played our best team and we've suffered because they've all got themselves injured? Joe, you know I think it was quite a, a very kind of a competent display. I thought they kind of did what they needed to do. We were kind of we were reliable. We just saw the job out. And I don't think really Kiev looked like threatening at any one point. It was just company and Otamendi. It's just I don't think you could have seen that coming too far. But it's, uh, it's it doesn't help, does it? People are saying, look, we're looking at Vincent Company, and he's never been 100% fit this season. What's going on with the physios and the medical team? I don't know. The worrying thing is that apparently uh, Guardiola's got an even worse record with Bayern, so uh, injuries for everyone next year, just like dishing them out. Uh, you have to wonder if it's just sheer bad luck or, or if there's something deeper, some problem that we need to get to the bottom of. But Company was doing this whole thing, saying how he's never felt more alive, like a teenager or whatever, and then six minutes in, he's on the floor and... It's just awful, isn't it? It's awful. Is this going to affect the derby? <laughs> Demi's got this, man. Demi's got it. I'll tell you what, Demi, Kalis, and Mangala both played well tonight when they came on. I know it's only Kiev. There's and the one whole moment where um, they kind of just went a bit Keystone Cops and they kind of nearly ran into each other and whatever, but you kind of allow them that. It's funny, you know. So <laughs> It's funny. <laughs> <laughs> to City fans, I'm just, oh, it's a laugh, isn't it? <laughs> I, I laughed, you know. But, um, but... It's, I think we can still kind of. I think this should be alright to be honest. I think it's one of those things where the underdogs could step up, you know, and they could have the kind of the game of their kind of game of their season for them or whatever. And I, I think look at this way. Who thought Willie Caballero turned himself exactly, into a city yeah. hero? And and now it's, it's, it's Demichelis' time to shine. And um, I, I think we'll, I think we'll actually be alright. Weirdly, I'm not one for over positivity, but I've got a feeling they'll step up and kind of do a consistent job. Sit here in the quarterfinals of the Champions League. That's got to be a plus, though. We're surely we're buzzing yeah. about that. Well, what's the point of this whole thing and going to football and having all this investment and years of kind of watching these other clubs being that one team left, uh, being that one team left in the Champions League, which is now likely to be us, and that's what it's all about. And it will be good. And with a little bit of luck, we could end up in the semi-finals, and who knows, you know, from there. I'll tell you what, as well. What are United fans doing tonight? They're at home watching us in the Champions League, so it's surely we're doing something right. Being all bitter and all that, you know. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you are, Blues. You heard it here from Stephen. Is at least we're the Champions League. We've got some it going, and don't worry too much about the derby. This is Blooming Rising TV. Subscribe below. Shh.